you smile or drink? No, thank you. I'm justly charged. You have the tailgate? Why? Have you seen him? I may have seen his hoverboard outside Gateway's hub site. It's on me. I owe you for swerves. I have been drunk this in years. It's good for drowning sorrows and for stealing one's nerves. Friend or foe, you tell me. Ew. Sorry about the mess. What mess? No, but that's what people say in these situations, isn't it? Come on, come on in. Sorry about the mess. How was your trip? What brings you here at this hour? I don't know. I was never entertained before. How am I doing so far? You make these? Why so many? Because I can't make mistakes. They all look the same to me. What do you want anyways? Just start to annoy me. I wanted to talk to you about Tailgate. In part, I suppose, for a long time after the launch, it was just the two of us. But now he seems to spend so much of his time. Nearly all of his time with Gateway. And I worry. I don't think Gateway has his best interests at heart. He tells him what he wants to hear. I tell him what he needs to hear. Except, I don't do that anymore. I don't know what to do. It's difficult to talk about it. Do you want to know what I- Wait, sorry, is there anything you want to say before I jump in? No. In which that case. <laughs> priceless. Absolutely priceless. Coming soon, Cyclops and Trilax, and my friend's got a new friend. You devil, I thought this was like a death dot. Sad, boohoo relationship problems. Here you go, have a reality check, free of charge. By sheer coincidence, you and Pan Button ended up being roommates. What makes you think there was any connection beyond that? The only thing you guys got in common is our front door. I saved his life. And? So what he owes you? You own him? He's not allowed to make other friends? I... I care about him. Again, so what? Here's a thought. Maybe he just likes Gateway more than he likes you. Would anyone find that surprising? What can you offer him apart from a guaranteed disapproval and a face like a funeral? All you do is stare out the window. My advice to you? Get over it. Because he's clearly over you. And let's face it, he's better off with some other guy. Thank you. Cyclonus, wait up. There are 200 of us on the ship. And you came here to see me. Why? Why would you do that? Because whenever it was out of fear or friendship, everyone else would tell me something they thought I wanted to hear. I'll be tailgate to their gateway. You don't care. You're not afraid of me. And you certainly don't consider me a friend. I came here because I knew you would tell me the truth, even if it hurt me. 